we got invited to go and visit Shanghai with Solar Juice and also some of our friends in the industry. So we went with Penrith Solar Centre, NRG Solar from South Australia and Springer Solar from Queensland. The reason for the trip was to go and visit a number of the manufacturers that we work with. We went and saw the Schleder manufacturing facility, then we went and saw SunGrow, then we went to Trina, and then lastly, we rounded out the trip by going to see the Tesla Gigafactory. So starting off with Schleder, it was good to be able to go and see a racking manufacturer. Seeing the process from start to finish was pretty impressive. They take a lot of guidance from what the market needs. There's been feedback given to Schleder around certain products and being able to see how they've adapted some of their products to make life easier on a rooftop or on a ground mounted system. It's very clear that Schleder are really looking to the market to give them guidance on how they should build their products. Like even just clip lock clamps, right? They come to site and they're all assembled, for example. Whereas previously you'd have to build these clip lock clamps on site. Doing things like that makes our lives easier. It makes us more competitive, which in turn enables us to deliver a more competitive product to a customer and get more projects off the ground. The next facility we went to go and see was the SunGrow facility. Walking through their site, the amount of automation was very impressive. Some of the processes that I've seen at other various manufacturers around the world, you know, seeing that implemented in SunGrow was also pretty cool. The scale that they are building product at is, is unmatched. And seeing how they put their inverters through their paces and all the testing that they're doing and all the new products that are coming out, there's clearly a lot of money being spent on R&D and development, which is great to see. It's one thing to be doing testing in a lab and in perfect conditions, but being able to stress test the product in conditions that the inverters are likely going to face, it's extremely important. And you know, if they didn't do those types of things, we would run into problems over time on real sites. So I think the effort that they're showing in that space is pretty impressive. So we went and visited the Trina factory and we actually went to their headquarters. Again, lots of automation in this process and probably since the last time I saw a solar panel manufacturer, I think automation has increased. A lot of the human involvement is more around quality assurance and testing. So again, that gives you a little bit of confidence knowing the consistency of product that's flowing through and obviously they've been a big part of our success here in Australia. We've installed over 100 megawatts of the product over the last 10 or 11 years. It was good to be able to kind of eyeball what they're doing there and seeing now that we can talk to customers and say that I've actually been to the facility, see how they manufacture their product, understand the quality, and that's why we're confident in putting it on rooftops here in Australia. We went and visited the Tesla manufacturing or the Tesla Gigafactory. This was probably hands down the most impressive manufacturing process I've ever seen. The site produces a brand new Model 3 car every 40 seconds. If you think about that kind of speed, you, you probably think about urgency and you probably think about people running around and being quite stressed, but the whole manufacturing process was calm and the amount of people working on the production line by design, it's just amazing. As they're working on the car on the production line, all of their tools, all of the things that they need at that point in time travel down the production line with them. This is probably fairly standard in scale car manufacturing, but they're obviously doing it a little bit different to be able to reach that scale. It was pretty awesome to see the amount of cars that are being built. Obviously, the electric vehicle space is growing substantially and Tesla are a big part of that. It's really good for us to be able to go over and actually see what's going on overseas and in the manufacturing process for all these products we're putting on customers' rooftops. Our customers put their trust in us to pick the right products for them. You know, a lot of the time we're taking the manufacturer's word for what they're doing. So being able to go over there, see what's going on, ask questions, see different parts of the manufacturing process, especially around the quality assurance side, 
is really important. So then we can go back to our customers and we can put our hand on our heart saying, look, we've seen exactly what's going on over there. And we know that these products are gonna stand the test of time. So I think it's important that we do that for our customers. And I just wanted to say, you know, an extreme thanks to Solar Juice for giving us this opportunity. They look after us really well. And Solar Juice have been such a great partner of our business over the years, and we really appreciate them. So I just wanted to say thanks to Solar Juice.